Today from Republic Pictures is The Painted Stallion, the first of 12 weekly chapters debuted in theaters July 5th, 1937. In true cliffhanger style, it ends abruptly at the precise moment of imminent danger. Will the day be miraculously saved just in the nick of time? Find out and watch this Pizza Flix cliffhanger serial marathon. Until the next time, may the sauce be with you. your men under cover. And don't fire until I give him my signal. Right. Thank you. 
Arrow. A whistling arrow warned the fur train before they got into range. After that, we could do nothing. Ah, it's time we put a stop to these, these interferences. All the peons and all the Indians think for sure that the stallion is a ghost horse and a rider in Indian spirit. No spirit ever shot an arrow like this. But it looks like we are pursued by evil spirits. Mexico has broken away from Spain. A Mexican governor is on his way to take my place. Then there we can no longer collect revenue from the traders? No. My authority from the Spanish crown ends when he arrives. He need never arrive. In that case, they would only send another governor. Mexico intends to establish trade relations with the United States. I've heard about that. There's a man named Jameson going to try and bring a wagon train through from Independence. Hmm. We shall be able to seize this Jamison train, eh? Not if a trade treaty is accomplished with the United States. But you might see to it that there be no agreement. There's an American official on his way here to negotiate with the new governor. If he fails to arrive, we might substitute one of our own men. I see, Your Excellency. This American will come by the way of independence. I call it, trying to send a wagon train to Santa Fe. Mr. Jameson! Mr. Jameson! Mr. Jameson! Yeah, here I am, Joe. Steamboat's around the bench. He'll dock in a few minutes. Good. Clark Stewart's on that boat. Joe, check these. I want to meet him. <laughs> There's a heap of runaway kids hankering to go west and get aboard these river boats. Seems to me I've seen the youngster you're looking for. I'm sorry, sir. <laughs> oh, that's all right. Him, Clark Stewart. Here's your hat. 
Thank you, son. Thank you, mister. There's the young'un I was telling of. Kind of young to be traveling on the river, ain't you? No, sir. I saw a notice posted that a young scamp had run away from his lawful guardian. Seems to me you fit the description pretty good. Why aren't you apprenticed to a saddle maker? Well, I... I... Pardon me. This lad's traveling with me, Marshal. Well, that makes a heap of difference, Mr. Stewart. Sorry to have troubled you. That's all right. What's your name, son? Christopher, sir. Christopher, eh? That's too long a name. We'll change that to... Kit. What'd you run away for, Kit? I just had to come west to be a scout, sir. I just had it. I see. What's your last name, Kit? Carson, sir. Kit Carson, eh? Oscar. This is my cousin, Elmer. 
What happened? Well, I, I could, I couldn't, I couldn't, I couldn't, I couldn't, I couldn't say what, 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 what was it? <laughs> he couldn't say whoa. you've eaten, son. Well, I... I ate at Independence. I guess maybe we better see the cook and get you some supper. You see, a uh, scout with this train's got to keep his strength up. Yes, sir! I'll go with you, you little scamp. I've been thinking that me and you'd better scout on the head of the train for the next few days sort of calculate on meeting up with some of our boys from Santa Fe. Did Mr. Jamison really mean I could be a scout? I reckon so, Kit. There must be a heap of engines and outlaws that need fighting. The West is too big for those hankering to spoil it, Kit. They may try for a while, cause a lot of trouble, maybe kill a lot of good men. West to win out. <laughs> this wild country we're traveling across will someday be settled. There'll be railroads pushing all the way across to the Pacific. The land will be covered with farms, ranches, and homes. Youngsters like yourself, Kit, might even be going to school somewhere as close by. <laughs> oh, I wonder how many of them will be a knowing a young fella named Kit Carson first became a scout in these here woods. You, Smith, horn in with the train and make sure that this Clark Stewart don't get into Santa Fe. You two, stick with your scouting. I'm heading for the Comanche village. You going to set the engines on the train? I'm going to try. Why, them Comanches will massacre the whole outfit. That's exactly what I'm figuring. All right, fellas, now left. Hey, Jameson, a man by the name of Bull Smith just come in. Says he's from the Lieutenant Governor of Santa Fe. Where is he? Up ahead. Ah, how are you? I'm Jameson. Howdy. Lieutenant Governor sent me out to give you a hand getting into Santa Fe. Well, that's fine. We sure appreciate his help. All set! All right, stretch out! I see that you get a fresh mouth. Let's fly. Destroy the Comanche people. Take their lands. Drive off their horses.
smoke signals. Looks like bad medicine to me. Clark, better scout ahead. Right. I'll take a look. Can I go too? Stay here, Kent. on the war path. engine attack. Thank <laughs> you. 
hadn't called off those engines. We'd sure be in a mess of trouble. Whoever it is, we're mighty thankful. We thought you was gone for sure when the engines jumped us and you wasn't here. You were nearly right, kid. Did I stop and say, man, blame if I wouldn't like us, I'd like us, I'd like to kid I'd sure like to, sure like to thank that rider. Reckon I'd better do it for you. He don't stay in one place long enough for you to tell him. Maybe you'd do better if I asked Stuart to stand still. You tend to your own business, and I'll take care of Stuart. If he doesn't get you first. Don't worry. He didn't see me. I'll tell him I was out scouting, got cut off from the train. Are you coming with me? No. Your place is with a train. I go to Santa Fe. Well, you tell Dupree not to worry. Clark Stewart won't get there. See that he doesn't! Senor. And then what happened? Go on. Well, then the attack failed. There was nothing more we could do. Oh, there was nothing more you could do. No, senor. You see, they... You like your job, don't you? Very much. And how long do you think it'll last if Stuart makes a trade treaty with the Mexican governor? The new governor has not arrived yet. As for Stuart, Smith will take care of him. You are to see that he does. Si, sí, senor. We better get across the river before that storm breaks. Or else we may be held up for weeks. All right. We gotta get along faster. side of that wagon? Well, you see this, don't you? What's the game, man? You're as close to Santa Fe as you're gonna get, Stuart.
Now turn him loose. Now start running. Scared to shoot a man that's facing you? Oh! A whistling arrow. The rider. back to that wagon train. Mount up.
Near that wagon before you got there? It all happened so fast, I. Yes, I saw Macklin. Macklin? He was swimming away from the wagon. You're cold, kid. Let's dry off and we'll find the rest. Joe, you can get that fixed by morning. Hey, Jameson. Have either of you fellas seen Clark Stewart? No, I haven't seen him. Macklin, come here a minute. Yeah, careful now. Don't you worry about me. What you want? You seen Clark Stewart? Stewart? Why, didn't he get that wagon through? What wagon? Why, he was driving Elmer's wagon. I seen he was having a little trouble, but I was too far away to how help. How far away? Stuart! Just how far away were you from my wagon? Where? I just happened to see a wagon drifting. I was way up the river. That's not so. I tell you, Clark, I saw him swimming right by your wagon. Oh, don't pay no attention to that kid. What are you sore about? Is it my fault you couldn't get that wagon across? I think it was. What do you mean? Someone was in that wagon and knocked me out. All right, I was in your wagon. But you ain't gonna do nothing about it. Jury tomorrow morning, you know, after your temper's cooled down a little. Your mistake, Macklin, was picking the wrong fella to fool around with. Put him in the wagon, boys. Give him a fair trial. Come on. I'll keep an eye on him. All right.
Yes, sir. He, 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 he's, he's going to help me out. He ain't here. What? Oh, he, 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 must, he must have snapped. He must have been asleep. Been, he's been dozing. Yeah, I reckon so. He couldn't have gotten loose by himself. Oscar, have you seen anyone else around here? Nary a soul. That's funny. Too bad he got away, though. Well, maybe it's just as well. How so? He's not the only one trying to stop me from getting through to Santa Fe. Do you think he was sent here to prevent you negotiating with the Mexican governor? I'm sure of it. We only knew who was back of all this. Macklin might give us a clue to that. I'm going to trail him. Let me go with you, Clark. I'm good at trailing. Sorry, kid. Not this time. Wait a minute. That's not such a bad idea. I'd like you to keep in touch with the train, Clark. I'd come in handy if you wanted to send a message back or something. And besides, you never can tell. You're liable to get into trouble. Maybe you're right, kid. Get your horse saddled. I didn't think it'd be this easy to trade them. Come on, kid. Any more tracks? The ground was too hard when he passed. We're still on the right trail. How do you know? What was the color of Macklin's horse? Uh, black. Right. And he had a long tail, long enough to get caught on that bush as he went by. Mm -hmm. We've cornered the writer in the painted stallion. Wait a minute. How'd you do it? Where is he? We've got him bottled up in a canyon. They ain't got a chance of getting away. Where? At the Red Cliffs. At the Red Cliffs? Yeah, yeah. A couple of the boys are standing guard. Come on, boys. to warn the rider.
him trapped, all right. The only way out of here is over that cliff down below. But he won't try that. I'll go down below and try to get close enough for a good shot. before he can reload.
up while I come up. Hurry! end of them. We'll go down the river and make sure they're done for.
here and see if we can pick up the trail. Come on. curious about that rider. I wonder who she is. Good with Jameson? Well, I guess so. Suppose he could talk Jameson into bringing that wagon train through Hondo Gap? Well, I reckon he could. Why? I'm a thinking that a few kegs of gunpowder could do a heap of damage in Hondo Gap. Hey, I'll be at a seeing old room, and I'll tell him about it. Trouble again. Renegades are mighty anxious to keep us from getting to Santa Fe. Yes, we got to be doubly cautious. Well, there's one thing, Sarton. That mysterious rider's on our side. It's Oldham. I found a new path to the mountain. It's a lot easier for the wagons. Is that out of our way? No. Shorter, if anything. A pass through the mountains, eh? Has it got a name? They call it Hondo Gap. You know anything about it, Bowie? Well, I've heard of it, but I ain't never been through it. 
All right, we'll try it, Oldham. You take the lead. Got them holes all dug? Yeah. I've got enough cotton powder to blow the whole face of the cliff off. Good. Let's get it planted quick. Got that fuse, Macklin.
Put out that fuse, Macklin. save what's in it. Oh, I'll take care of that. Bowie, you sure did do me a good turn. Oh, that's all right. I think we can get those wagons through. That blast didn't do much damage. I'm going after those renegades. They're dead set against us reaching Santa Fe. It's a good idea. Go ahead, Clark. I'm going along, too. My dad is up, and I've got to find me an outlaw. Let off steam. better separate. If either of us get in trouble, we'll fire a shot. All right, Clark. Good luck. United States government. Where's he keep? I don't know. You better talk and talk fast. Thank you. 
Just what we were looking for. I'm a riding to Santa Fe with these pronto. What about Clark and the kid? You finish them off. I'll meet you later at the hideout. That was a real night throw, Jim. Quit the shooting and got here as soon as I could. Jim, I got my credentials. It was Macklin. I heard him say he's going right to Santa Fe with him. And I'm going after him. Tell Jameson I may need some help. Good luck, Clark. I told you I'd get him, and here they be. These, any treaty between the United States and Mexico can be arranged exactly as we want it. Did you have much trouble? No. Where's Clark Stewart? He's dead. Lieutenant Governor's place. I don't know what business Macklin has in there, but I'm going to find out. 
Dave, right out toward Hondo Gap. You'll meet Bowie coming in. Tell him where to find me. Well, watch yourself, Clark. You tell me that Clark Stewart's dead. Now you tell me he's alive and after you. I suggest your excellency double the guard around the presidio. Well, I'll get him. Next time, the I... next time, back. Promises and excuses, but always failure. I want to see. And tell the captain to bring six soldiers. Your Excellency? Yes. We've captured a spy. I wish him executed. He's hiding in that club. Wait. I see no reason to disturb him. You may shoot him where he stands. Captain, place your men. When I give the signal, fire into it. Well, shut it!
I suggest your excellency double the guard around the presidio. Well, I'll get him. Next time, Not I... next time, back. Promises and excuses, but always failure. Tobek. Tell the captain of the guards I want to see. And tell the captain to bring six soldiers. Sent for me, Your Excellency? Yes. We've captured a spy. He's hiding in that closet. Wait. I see no reason to disturb him. You may shoot him where he stands. Captain, place your men. When I give the signal, fire into him. Let's gun it! Ready. hiding in my headquarters. We are a new country, senor. Our enemies are not treated kindly. But I'm not an enemy. If you will take me to your governor... Our new governor has not yet arrived in Mexico City. Until he does, I am in full charge. Why, then you're the man I want to talk with. Well, I'll listen to what you have to say. I'm Clark Stewart. I'm authorized to represent the United States government in trade negotiations with Mexico. Oh, I see. And your credentials? That man stole them. It's a serious charge, senor. Macklin, is this true? No. I don't know what he's doing here, but he's sure a lying about me. It's only your word against his, and Macklin's known to us. My friends arrived, they can identify me. You were caught spying. As Lieutenant Governor of Santa Fe, I sentence you to be shot. you want. Get your men together. We are going to ambush the wagon train tomorrow morning before it reaches Santa Fe. I sure will.
can't capture them now. Let's get back to Santa Fe before they recognize us. Good evening, senores. We're all looking for Clark Stewart. Come in, gentlemen. Perhaps I can help you. I don't believe we've met. I'm the Lieutenant Governor, Alfredo Dupree. Jameson's my name. Oh, Senor Jameson. My good wishes have been with you on your long trip. Thank you. This is Jim Bowie, Davy Crockett. My house is yours. Tomorrow, my aide. We come here looking for Clark Stewart. Oh, the agent of your government. Oh, then you know his mission. Yes, he presented his credentials to me. It seems as though they had been stolen, but uh, he succeeded in recovering them. Where is he now? He rode out to meet the uh, new governor who was coming from Mexico City. Uh, won't you be seated, gentlemen? He must have left mighty sudden. He did. He was anxious to contact the governor. Sit down, senor. <laughs> he's been scouting so long he's not accustomed to chairs. I know how you feel, Jim. You like to see what's going on behind you. Yeah, that's what's kept me alive this long. Well, I don't see why... why uh, we needn't take up any more of your time, sir. Our wagons will arrive in the morning. My people will be very happy to welcome you Americans. Thank you, and... Good night. Pues sí, amigos. Tomorrow there will be a fiesta in honor of your arrival. Hey, what in coronation's idea you believe in that bomber? I don't believe a word he said. Neither do I. Well, then why'd you... If he is land and Clark's in trouble, it's safer for Clark if Dupree thinks he has his food. It's time we put a stop to these interferences. Tomorrow we will steal their powder wagon. Then they will be helpless. What do you want me to do? We'll stick together and be ready to act quick. Oh. There's Dupree now. He ain't gonna get out of my sight, but he's mounted. That's all right, so will I be. Well, let's just go over here and look at these knives. Jim. 
What do you want? Are you not going to the fiesta? No. I'm guarding our camp. Hitch a couple teams into this wagon quickly. How about the other wagon? Leave them. This load of powder is all we want. Follow me to the south. We're taking Clark Stewart with us. Get up.
Good girl. Get the powder wagon as fast as you can to the cliff. Santa Fe, we will sign a treaty with the United States that will prove very harmful to us. I understand. You want me to see that he does not arrive? Yes, one. And you will be the new governor. Me. Unless a governor arrives, the Americans will know something is wrong. But if you arrive as the governor, with his power... I see, senor. But how? It is arranged. Please come home. Huh? I got work to do. You sit down all the time. 
my Bora trick. You want to buy him, senor? Oh, no, 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 no. Uh -uh. Wait! I give him to Hey, Mr. Nakam, I don't want that. I don't want that. Hey, what's, 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 his, what's his name? Rodrigo Emanuel Hernandez de Cordoba. Adios, senor. Stay here, Juan, till we get things ready for you. Welcome to Santa Fe, Your Excellency. Thank you. I've been sent out by the folks in town to greet you. I am indeed honored. Pedro, drive on. Oh, 
money business on me, neither. What's the meaning of this? Never mind the questions. Come on, climb down out of that coat. Come on, get moving. Whistling arrow! Rider!
taking his secretary prisoner. Senor. And what is your name? Clark Stewart. And you are the new governor? Si, senor. And I am very anxious to get to Santa Fe. I'll be glad to drive you there. Thank you. I tell you, we couldn't do nothing more. There was too many for it. It all happened so sudden like. You say this man's the governor's secretary? Uh, yeah. Now tell me, does the new governor intend to garrison Santa Fe? I do not know, senor. Tomorrow, the leather might refresh his memory. Tell me, are troops on the way from Mexico City? He will communicate with the president when he desires troops. How does the governor communicate with the president? By letter, stamped with his private seal. Cut him down. With that seal in my possession, I will still rule Santa Fe. Yes, but how are you going to get this seal? You're going to get it for me. You and Topek. Topek knows every room and passage in the Presidio. You will go there tonight. He's gone! Reset the trap. treaty with your country, permitting the sale and exchange of merchandise, but... Uh, but uh, your excellency has the power to sign the trade agreement. Yes, I have the power to sign the agreement, gentlemen. But when I sign this agreement, my government becomes responsible for the welfare of all Americans trading in our country. Now, I would gladly accept this responsibility, but for one thing. You mean to pre and his outlaws? Exactly. Until my position is strengthened here, yeah, there's nothing I can do. If Dupree were removed, would you sign? With pleasure.
comfortable quarters been arranged for Senor Jameson and his friends? Yes, Your Excellency. They occupy the guest building across the patio. Very good. Good night. Good night, Your Excellency. The success of our entire expedition depends on rounding up these renegades. Yeah. They must first locate Dupree. I hope you can sleep in that thing. Yeah, I'd much rather sleep in a wagon, Kim. We'll start trailing the tree first thing in the morning. The whistling arrow. The rider. Something's wrong. Put up the canvas. Someone in the governor's study. Better investigate. We'll split up and each take a different entrance. I'll take the side door, boy. You go around back, all right? Bring him here. Understand. Will you help me? Help? Yes, me help. Wait. I want you to shoot this arrow at the wagon train. 
Wagon train? Yes, wagon train. Again, Clark Stewart. This is no doubt your last meeting with anybody. Well, I'm glad you saw fit to leave a note in your handwriting. I shall make good use of this. Right. First one to make a move gets it. Come on, follow me through this doorway.
meet again, Clark Stewart. This is no doubt your last meeting with anybody. Well, I'm glad you saw fit to leave a note in your handwriting. I shall make good use of this. Right. First one to make a move gets it. Come on, follow me through this doorway. Come on! We'll get the Americans safely out of the way. With them gone, Santa Fe will have little defense. Exactly. It will be the time for us to strike. Oji. Shoot this into Jameson's wagon train. Be sure no one sees you. out for himself.
Can you help me out of here? Thank you very much, miss. We're going to wipe that gang out this time. A whistling arrow! There's a message on it. It's from Stewart. He's located Dupree. Meet him on the east fork of the Roy and Seco. Well, we'll polish him off. Get your horses and guns, man. Let's get going. Wait a minute. Rocket, you boy and kids stay here. We can't leave this place deserted. All right. I don't see why I can't go. Well, you've got to stay here and help us, kid. this way. You're not. Have located. Say, you praise change this. Must be a trap. We better get back to Santa Fe.
successfully thanks to you Americans.
he's going to be all right. Of course I'm all right. Well, I'm sure glad of that, son. You sure had a close call. I think we'd better take him over to camp. Let me go. I'm all right. I can walk. Are you sure you're all right? Sure I am. Oh. I tried to catch them, Jameson. They had too much of a start. Any of your men hurt? No, not bad. Where's Bowie? I don't know, but those bandits had a prisoner that sure looked like him. You hear that, Jameson? Yeah. and go after the rider. This is our chance to catch him. There are other ways. The rider is trapped. Two of my men have the rider and stallion trapped in Box Canyon. We'll go after them this afternoon when the rest of the men get here. Take the prisoner below. Come on, you. But I do not understand. You are not very clever, Zamaro. You should know that Clark Stewart will try to rescue the rider. True, senor. If he thought the rider were in danger. But if he doesn't know that, he will.
Don't move or look around until I tell you. Regular scout, yes. Hey, yeah. Get your horses! Hey, Gavin! The rider. They've cast the rider and the stallion. What? They're cornered in Box Canyon. How do you know? I heard the free talking about it. They caught me, but I got away. Good morning, Ben. We gotta land a hand. Box Canyon. I don't see no sign of them. They must be further in. They're coming. Wait till they get closer to us. They got us cut off. Yeah, and we gotta make every shot count. We got him now. So that powder runs out. Two out of two ain't bad. Get around behind them. You all can make a try for it. I don't think you'll ever make it, Clark. It's worth a try. I'll head up the slope and circle around. Go ahead, Clark. We'll keep you covered. Yeah, and we'll make it hot for them. All set? Go ahead. Ah! 
Hazard! Come on. How's our chance? 
job. My friends, where'd they go? Friends? Yes, my people. Where did they go? Your people? Go there. To Dupree? Yes, to Dupree. I've got to get to them right away. Thanks very much. Maybe someday I can repay you. enough of us to rush them. I'll go back to town and get more men. Go ahead, son. We'll move up and hold them off till you get back. tunnel and be 20 miles away before they know we're going.
Over there. This way. No, don't go. My friends, I've got to help my friends. Help, friends? Yes, help. I know. Well, I guess you know your own country best.
Gentlemen, this is a pleasure. We've got to get out of here. The plunder, quick! Try to get to the secret tunnel. You leave that to me. Take them up there and string them across a ledge that leads to the tunnel. They'll make good targets for their friends. We are not taking them with us. No, it'll be my pleasure to shoot them before we go. Come on, let's get out of here. Get up there. Let's go. shooting anyway. Every one of them skips away through that tunnel. Yeah, and we can't stop them. Come on, boy. Out of here before they pick us all off. Ah! Quick, I'll saddle my horse. I'm going to fix that painted stallion.
her and put her with the rest. They've got the rider. Get the other chest. Everything all set? Yes. I'll be right with you. I have a little job to do. You, Bowie. You're first. this agreement, establishing trade relations between your country and mine. Americans will now be more than welcome in Santa Fe. Your mission here has been successfully accomplished. Well, Jameson, your trade route's all set now. Congratulations. It's been entirely due to your help. The writer of the painted stadium, whoever she may be, there's a story among the Comanches of a baby girl, the sole survivor of a massacred settlement. She was raised by the Comanches? Yes. And because of her golden hair, they worship her as a goddess, a goddess of peace. And she grew up but with one thought in mind, to preserve peace and prevent bloodshed. Are you sure you don't want to come back to Independence with this kit? Coming right back with another wagon train. I know, Mr. Jamison. I'd a lot rather stay here. <laughs> Davy Crockett and me kind of figured on taking the young'un under our wing. And we sort of figured that Kit Carson might make a pretty good scout one of these days. <laughs> Darn shame you can't learn the fern lingo they speak around here. Maybe you wouldn't have to go back. Of course, you don't speak your own language very well. No, that that that's reckon that's cause I I I that's cause I stutter. Yeah. You know, you know it's kind of kind of huh, Foster? Wait, just that's 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 stutter. You know it it's it's kind of. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Quadruped, you unutterable species of desert canary, you malformed remnant of noise and wind, I am completely amazed that a noisy wart on the face of existence can so arouse my contempt. You bothersome beast, I denounce you henceforth. Well, I'll be doggone. 